Julia, what are you what are you doing? I'm just sitting here getting ready. This is called prepping. I'm eating right now, but I'm going to get some ham and some sausage. And that's going to be so good. It's really on? It's wet. That means we need to talk. What's up, happy people? I'm Robert Arrington. This is Deer Meat for Dinner, and this is my wonderful family. This is Aria, Emma, and Mama. This is Sarah. And did you know I had cake, too? <laughs> How can you deal with that? <laughs> but um, seriously, we started Tasty Tuesdays about seven years ago in our condo when it was just Sarah and I. And that was kind of like the start of Catch, Clean, and Cook, which now everyone on YouTube wants to make a Catch, Clean, and Cook video, but that all really started with our Tasty Tuesdays way, way back in the day. Now, we want to bring Tasty Tuesday back every single Tuesday here on Deer Meat for Dinner. You're going to get to see some of us. And I'm going to get salad. You're going to make a salad? Absolutely. But this is the kitchen. This is where it's gonna go down. We may have celebrity chefs come in. We may have local chefs from our local restaurants come in. Or it may just be Sarah and I, or it may be some of our friends. Yeah, or it may or be my Emma with, a whisk. with her whisk. But the key is, or my friends. every Tuesday, you are gonna see a Tasty Tuesday right here. And these videos are meant to empower the families all around the world. Get together as a family, cook a meal, have fun, turn off your devices, sit around the dinner table, and enjoy a meal together. That's what we're gonna do. And it may be crazy, but I guarantee you it's gonna be real. This is what we're gonna do to start off with. Okay, put that in there. That's a couple teaspoons of garlic, actually a little more. There you go. Put that down right there. This is the juice from one Meyer lemon. Pour it in there. That's a couple pieces of anchovy that's diced up very fine. Okay, who's next? Oh, let Emma do the egg. She already touched it. Okay, put the egg in there. One egg yolk. Perfect. Next, nope, this goes in last. Okay, put in this. Here you go. That's half a cup, one half a cup of olive oil, and this is a half a cup of grape seed oil, and some of it got on her, but you know what? That's okay, here you go. Perfect. That's Dijon mustard. Now let's, let's whisk this in here. Whisk, whisk, whisk. Is this a Caesar salad? Making homemade Caesar. You're whisking it so good. Now, hold on, let me hold this for a second. I'm gonna come right over here and just show the camera. Look at the, look at the consistency there. Are you kidding me? That's going to be so good. Okay, put it in the bowl. Perfect. Hold on, Aria, wait, 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 wait. Now, the last two pieces this is actually just an idea of mine. That's some prosciutto. It's like a uh, Italian cured meat. And we're gonna just... We're gonna just take that. Hold on, hold on. I don't wanna mince it up too fine but that's what I'm looking for. Now, we can just take a little of this prosciutto, put right on top. This is like a little cured Italian ham. And then next, we're gonna take, this is some nice Parmesan cheese. And we'll just, actually, you know what? We can probably do it just like this. How does that look? Are you kidding me? I don't want cheese on mine. 
You don't want cheese on yours? Mama wants cheese on hers. If this is your first time watching our channel, I will just let you know, we specialize in catching, cleaning, and cooking wild game, fish, and all kinds of crabs and lobsters. That's a yellowtail snapper. We caught it yesterday, right out here, offshore Jupiter, Florida. A little buddy of mine, Carson, caught it. What a beautiful fish. Just to show you the difference, that's like your normal keeper size. That is what we would refer to as a flag. That's a nice, large yellowtail. And we're gonna cut it into fillets right now, fillets. Super easy. One of the easiest fish in the world to fillet. Come right down the back there. Cut right along the backbone. Doesn't really get much more simple or easy than that. Um, if you think about Florida seafood, it's hard not to think about a yellowtail snapper. Uh, we want this boneless and skinless. So we just fillet it, took the skin off, and then the last piece right here, there's a little bit of pin bone. Do that. Now check it out. See this? Watch this. Bam. And there you have it. Very simple, we've got our snapper filleted. We're gonna add a little bit of fresh cracked pepper. And a little bit of Everglades fish and chicken. One of my favorites. We're gonna go very light on our seasoning and we're only seasoning half the fish. I just don't wanna overpower it. I wanna really let you taste it. Getting everything prepped, we are going to set our lower oven to 300 degrees. <laughs> Here's a very good tip. I get these at Publix as well. They're called Bruce Sweet Potatoes. Leave them in the bag. Just set them down just like that. Close it. Eight minutes, start. That's gonna be the easiest baked sweet potato you've ever had in your entire life. And we're gonna light our center Boom. We've got that going just like that. Very little. This is the Kerrygold Irish butter, and I swear by it. It has the creamiest, most wonderful flavor ever. Got our butter going. Throw our sweet potatoes right in there. Take a little original Everglades. Season it up and toss it. And all we're doing is trying to let that butter coat the outside of our green beans. Everyone's had steamed green beans, sauteed green beans is where it's at. Now we're gonna start off with our two thickest pieces of fish. We're gonna go seasoning down just like that. Whew, look how pretty that is. It's, you, it's like you can almost see through it. Translucent, beautiful, just a wonderful flavor. Anytime you toss your greens like that, it just coats them in your seasoning and the butter and the love. <laughs> Woo, this looks so good. You're not trying to overdo it here, you're just trying to let this get nice. Watch this. Perfect. That's perfection, you guys. Now our fish is perfect. We wanna just put it on that pan, just like that. Then we're gonna put it in our oven. Take our two other pieces, just like this. There we go. That's fresh tarragon. This is gonna be for our sauce. I just wanna get some of that out right there. And I just bunch it up and just. All right, babe, we're getting so close. Our fish just lays out nice and flat. Take these two, put them on there. 
We'll put them right back in the oven. That's gonna finish them, but more than anything, it's just gonna keep them nice and warm. Now you might ask yourself, why are you cooking in cast iron when I could be cooking in a non-stick? And there's a reason, check this out. I've got a little bit of ginger. I'm gonna put that right in here. Nice ginger. And I'm gonna let this come around. Fills up the whole house with a beautiful aroma. And then we're gonna deglaze the pan with a little Sauvignon Blanc. Take some of that Kerrygold butter, put it right in there. I've turned the heat down to very, very, very low. Now all the flavor, everything is starting to come together. As this starts to just reduce down, you're gonna have all the flavor that was attached to that cast iron skillet and it all becomes happy. And the last thing we're gonna do, we're gonna take a good healthy pinch of this tarragon and it's kind of a visual thing. That's, that's about how much you want right there. And then we're just gonna whisk that in. That tarragon is just gonna come to life. Turn the heat up just a little bit. The thicker you want the sauce, the more you reduce it. Whenever I say reduce, I mean you're just boiling it down. But if you boil it too fast, you're gonna burn it and just, you're gonna ruin it. That's what I'm looking for. That's the perfect dish. Remember whenever I did the sweet potatoes? This is all you've gotta do. Cut them. And now, your sweet potatoes are ready for action, just take them and set them on your plates. That's going to be so good. This is a honey butter, it's got a little cinnamon in it, and all you've gotta do is put a little dollop on your, your baked sweet potato, and life is good. Now here's our green beans. You basically cook the green beans until you think they're, they're done. Turn off the heat, and then they just start absorbing all of that flavor and you are good to go. Now, here we go. Oh, that looks perfect. Make sure we turn this off so I don't forget later. That fish is gonna be just perfect. This sauce just looks amazing. And all we're gonna do is just spoon a little bit of it right on there. Hey girls, come on, let's eat. Check it out, you guys, that's what we have. We have our baked sweet potato, sauteed green beans, our seared yellowtail snapper filet with a little wonderful sauce. You call it what you wanna call it, I call it. It's gonna be really good. Now let's go eat. Okay girls, let's say our blessing, okay? Hey, okay, let me hold your hand. Oh, that one looks like a There you go. Oh, there you go, good deal. Lord, thank you so much for this day. Thank you for this food. Thank you for our family and our friends and all the many blessings you've given us. Lord, I pray that you watch over each and every one watching this video today. I pray that you keep your hand upon them, guide them and direct them. Lord, please nourish this food to our body and forgive us of all of our sins. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. 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 Now, I'm gonna put just a little bit of this sauce on here. Mmm. I want to just take a taste of this for y'all. I've never put prosciutto on a salad before. Mmm. There's something about that salad dressing that just lights me up. I love it. The cheese, all the ingredients, the prosciutto, fantastic. <laughs> That's the first installment of Tasty Tuesday in a long, long, long time. Many, many, many years. There's nothing on my channel has been requested more than for Tasty Tuesday. And I promise you guys, it's coming back. We're gonna have our family, our friends, and all kinds of unique chefs in that kitchen right there doing Tasty Tuesday. Take care, God bless. <laughs>